Boy and the Lost Ball. Short stories by George Hutton. The year is 1924. London was rife with excitement. War was over. Everything was on the up. Everyone was so merry. Reminds me of a story. A young boy called William. And his football. Young William was nine. Such a young boy. Loved playing with his friends. His father, who loved football, decided one day to buy his son a brand new leather ball for Christmas. Oh my son, he's going to love this he is. I just know it. It would never leave young William's side. So attached was the young boy to his football that it even had a seat at the dinner table. Every day, after school, William and his friends would play for hours. Inside left, inside right, yeah, yeah, oh, it's a goal! But of course, that was after they'd finished their homework. Such joy it brought to William's face, until one day, the football, it went missing. William was so upset, he looked everywhere, high and low, inside and out. Mother, father, where's my football? Where is it? When all hope was lost, a young boy came knocking at William's door. William answered. There stood a young boy, covered in soup, barely a stitch of clothing. William knew this young boy was a chimney sweep, but under his arm was a red leather football. And the young boy said, I'm ever so sorry. I found this outside, j j just down the street there. My dad, well, he told me to give it back, but, but I swear I was going to give it back. Honest I was. William smiled. And he said with great delight, You found my ball. Let's have a game then. In the street. Come on. All was well. And William always treasured that red leather ball. Always.